let's evaluate this limit. So if we substitute x equals 1, we get a limit of 0 on 0, and we can apply al Hopital's rule. So we can actually simplify this limit by using the product rule for limits, and then multiplying and cancelling the factors out. But let's continue with al Hopital's rule. So using the chain rule in the numerator, and the product rule in the denominator, and we can see this is still a limit of 0 on 0, so we'll apply al Hopital's rule again. And now if we substitute x equals 1, we no longer have a limit of 0 on 0. So we obtain 0 on 6, which is 0.